Right, a quick video on the black tank, how it works and what it actually consists of, the parts. Right, these are the parts. This is the blank tank that we'll get to in a minute. This is the piece of pipe that actually goes from the tank through to the toilet. And then the toilet actually sits straight on the top like that. It's as simple as that. That's what you've got. The toilet, this piece of pipe, and a black tank. Now if you have a look at the profile of the tank, you'll see it's very shallow. It leads quite shallow here and then it goes down to a fall where the outlet pipe is there. Right now this piece of pipe here that goes down has a couple of bends in it as you can see. Now if you have a look at this, I'll show you how deep it is, you'll be quite surprised. See, we're only looking at about three inches or so from the bottom of the pipe to the bottom of the tank. Now, as you can imagine, if toilet paper, debris and everything else goes down there, that's going to block up fairly quick. So that is why it's very important to keep plenty of water going down the toilet. Now what happens is with the debris and everything going down here, this blocks up, you get a bit of a pyramid here and then the water will back up and go through into the toilet hence you think the toilet's blocked which it is um, so you start putting drain rods down and everything all it does is bang into the bottom of the tank and clears nothing that's why on our other video how to unblock a tank shows you the bit of blue pipe flicking around in there clearing it all away now the best way to maintain a black tank is to keep plenty of water in it if you don't keep plenty of water in it as you can imagine the solids will stay here the fluids will go down, when you empty it on a tote or something, the fluids will go, then all of a sudden you've got a blockage. Right, this is the side of the tank where all the business happens. This is the waste gate, obviously with the waste gate and the pipe which goes down to your tote or to your drain. These are the sensors here that tell you uh, the levels, like a third, a quarter, half, the full up. But as you can see, they're very basic. Now that's why, notoriously, they give you false readings. All you need is a bit of paper or a bit of debris on there for it to short out and you think it's half full and actually it's empty. This pipe here goes to the black tank flush. So that's where the water comes through and this will flush the tank out, you know, purging or anything out of there and keeping the tank nice and clean. Right, the key things to remember are, this is a black tank for a caravan. Basically, if it doesn't go through you, it won't go through this tank. So if you start putting wet wipes and all sorts of other things we found in them, it's going to block up. There's no two ways about it. Now, if you like these videos and you find them helpful, subscribe to our channel. We've got a whole series of videos and press the like button a few times. It helps us out. Thanks a lot.